from? Dominica. Mm. And you're from England. Yeah. I'm more Jamaican Ken. than any of you lot on here. I you're not. When was the last time you went to Jamaica? Nobody yeah. can't no, well on. No, well if it were I, I would say a brony. When you visit, you're a tourist. When I visit, it's a birthright. Now, I will say if you're of Caribbean heritage and haven't visited during adulthood, make it a cultural and financial priority. Further to that, get your heritage, passport and citizenship flex pack. If not for you, then for your descendants. Back to music, like Queen Ice Cream, I grew up on dancehall. He picked dancehall because the cultural appropriation pays him to. His career beforehand didn't work. How can you have a song called Big Blood Clark and you don't know what it means? Blood Clark. I don't really understand what that really breaks down into. <laughs> and yet you're questioning others about their knowledge of dancehall. TikToker Quincy speaks about gatekeeping the culture and I agree. Prior to this, I was approached by a well-known production company to feature in M.R's coming documentary about cultural appropriation and despite payment, I politely declined. The documentary was called White Line, which is a unique sighting when compared to the 